Okay guys, so it's Toke again with episode yeah. 5 of the Just Built series. And guess guy is still with me, we're doing this in one session, so if you have any ideas to improve it, don't be mad if we don't do it immediately. Because yeah. so, I also work on the LP series a bit and that takes some preparation. So I would say, let's start this off with the creepy guy behind me. <laughs> okay, so let's start the three. Uh, we're going to we're going to make the pathway to the tunnel over there. Maybe also do the tunnel from that village to the one behind the mountain ah, and yeah. build a uh, not really build but plant a little forest in here. So let's quickly see where should we make this go up. I would say around no one deeper around there. Yeah, great. <laughs> I would say what? I do the slabs. <laughs> yeah. And we just got the profile picture for the YouTube as well. <laughs> really funny picture. <laughs> yeah, just to one side. Oh, why is that so deep? Let's go up in. I can't really stand that empty spaces. Mm. Let's see a bit further. Still a bit more and let's turn around there. Maybe that's a bit too far. Ah, but we're gonna do it through a forest, so... Let's see how it ends out. No, hopefully we are getting some big trees as well. Now let's see. This goes down here again. Oh, I'm walking up on it. From here on, there a straight path, I would say. Yeah, straight. Okay, so like that. It's hard for me to keep up. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm just doing the outlines a bit. A bet. Yeah, so you know where the road should go, more or less. But we're also gonna build a station in here. Uh, maybe I'll go quickly take a look at that, where we're gonna put it. Did you see it? Guess guy, where it's gonna be? Nope. And then I would suggest you follow me, because it's gonna be a pretty big station, but... When this map is going on... It will keep expanding, so we're gonna get more and more towns. Oh, uh... Let's set my... Render distance a bit lower. Yeah, better. I don't really like the fog. Mm. So, as you can see, we have some nice hanging areas here. And underneath it, I would say, we put up the station and you have some skylights in here as well then seems good idea to me so I guess this would be a nice place of course we have to remove the gravel a bit and but still it's nice that's what you can't do with the uh, flat land work with the landscape it's just flat yeah, kind of explaining the name Flatland. <laughs> yeah, and it's slime infested as well, so... Yeah. Let's quickly finish this road. Quickly? It's going to take years. Yeah, well, I put the server on 
difficulty zero, so we're not gonna get any mobs in here. No, oh, that's good. So that pre preventing the or briefing like I did in the single player, just play on peaceful. Ender briefing. <laughs> yeah, or creeper briefing. Yeah, like, what was that person thinking when they said to Notch, Hey Notch, might you add griefers in single player? Great idea. Yeah, well, griefers are still worse than Enderman, but Enderman even yeah. creep if you're in... in creative. Yeah. And creepers don't, but creepers just take out bigger chunks of the... Yeah. I was doing this redstone thing and it's like I couldn't find the problem because I spent like a few days on it and it was this big binary counter and then I was like what's the problem I found an enderman uh, just holding a piece of red wool that a uh, redstone torch was on and I'm like seriously <laughs> yeah that's the problem with them um, you know with doing this, our inventory is yeah. going to be filled with so much crap, so much seeds and all. Yeah. Although, thing is, you can't actually see the inventory. Yeah, well, if you open a chest, you can see it. <laughs> yeah, and creative, it's just like, you open a chest, then you realize how many beds and stuff you have, <laughs> and you're like, oh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, what I don't get is why beds actually break. I think it's because you break one part and then the other part gives you the item or something. Yeah, probably. Well, it's Minecraft. Although, Minecraft logic. <laughs> uh, I mean, sure, surely programming-wise that could be solved by, like, one if statement, couldn't it? Yeah, probably. Hmm. Yeah, well, I'm not going back to the default texture pick for doing this, I did that. Maybe I'll do it once in a while, so you guys can see I'm what playing. how it looks like in the default texture pack. But I shall tell you, it looks pretty nice. Basically, yeah. I don't take a texture pack where something that looks in the default, that's looking good in the default, looks bad in. For combination like the off slabs and the stone bricks. Even in, the, even in the default, it looks nice. The type of texture packs that I don't like. <laughs> <laughs> Just bury me alive there. Um, yeah, the type <laughs> of texture packs that I get annoyed at is the ones that like say, oh, it's a brilliant uh, survival texture pack, but then the wool's got patterns and stuff, and it's like, yeah. no, it's, it's not really. Well, maybe, yeah, I think we should move the stair back a bit. stairs that's better so should we start planting the forest and bone meal it um yeah or just randomly let it grow but i think we should start planting it um yeah. don't mm, yeah, okay. yeah we should bone meal yeah well just randomly go around planting it I'll plant the ones next to the path, you plant the ones slightly further off. Because I'll try and get like an even sort of canopy. Oh, and maybe you we can make I mean. the, those glowing trees. Yeah. Well, I'm just plant randomly putting down trees in here, so... Yeah, I'll just put ones along the path, so it's like yeah. a big canopy. Yeah, well, I'm starting with the birds, and then I just randomly put in the other ones. And maybe we should let the uh, ones out more grow naturally, so... We don't prioritize birds or oak. Yeah, but how do you think that looks? I've got one four white oh, one there. Oh, that's a big tree. Yeah. Maybe they're a bit close to each other. Not really sure. 
Yeah, it's hard to get those big trees these days. You should uh, get them back what? in. Um, yeah. Make them quite common. Yeah. Like, that's the sort of big ones you get now. Yeah, you get small one. Oh, and now you have a big one. How much bone meal did you use on that? One. Oh. Don't really take more. Yeah. Either it was one or two, I'm not sure. But, um, okay, this one. Let's see. I'm randomly putting down those. I kind of think it should be... Oh, that's another one. But that one took like six. Um, yeah. Oh, another one, which took about 20. Well, <laughs> yeah, that's a problem with getting those big trees these days. Yeah. And another one. Oh. This is going to be a dark forest. Yeah. Maybe we should put some glowstone in between it randomly. I don't know. I think we should do it so it's just like impassable when you try and walk through it. Well, but I would say you need to make it so that mobs won't spawn it in it. Maybe that's ideal mm. <laughs> when we get tired of just building on this map. Make it into a adventure map. Yeah, we could. Um, I mean, with a map like this, you could put a good story in or something. Yeah, because you, you have big villages and everything. Yeah. And now you can even spawn NPCs in easily yeah so and we could do something where this forest burns down or something what no we could like burn down this forest in an adventure map or something who knows yeah see those trees are oh already got the apple up here nice oh big tree and one bone meal yeah see those birches are oh. randomly growing already Maybe I should start bone milling them as well a bit. Thing is, we can have a bit thinner once you get further out, but um, the bit next to the path we need to have really thick, so it looks yeah. impassable. Okay, that one isn't going to grow. Oh, Oop, another tree, and I don't see anything in anymore. Let's see, that's... Yeah, it's... <laughs> I'm here trying to plant a tree on sand, and I'm just like, that isn't <laughs> working. Um, oh, another big maybe one. Maybe we should make some trees ourselves, so we have some more birch in it. Because this hmm. is not really working to bone meal. I think it's working fine. Yeah, but the birches are harder to bone meal. Are they? Apparently. Mm. Yeah, they are. Um. Yeah, that's because they don't act like the oaks, and if you have a sapling underneath it, then it won't really grow easily. I guess the trick is then to plant the birches and bone meal them first. Probably. Yeah, well, we could. Oh, that's a nice tree. Oh, that's a big forest, and there's some decaying in it, so it looks natural and everything. What is it? There's some leaves are decaying, so it's starting to look really are natural. Mm, nice. Um, we should have some more birch in here. No, with the birch, it's nicer. Yeah. Sure, that one grows and that one doesn't. Maybe we should make a whole forest with glowstone in it. I don't know. Um, I think we should leave it dark. Oh yeah, wow! Yeah, but a uh, um, big forest with. So, do you think I should? Trim this bit uh, here. Wait, let me go see. What? <laughs> uh, 
I think we should make the path a bit clear. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah. on the sides, do um, I in the middle tree high? Yeah, yeah. Well, I guess we can hide some glowstone in here nicely. Oh, look at that. You have even have some sky views in here. Nah, crap. That's not gonna grow. I don't think much is gonna grow deep in the spot. Wow, um, this is insane. I think it would be best if we made it so you can't actually walk through the forest and you have to take the path. Yeah, maybe we shouldn't. Well, it's, there is a pathway, so why wouldn't you take that? Yeah. Let's see if I can get a virgin. Oh, there we have one. Okay, and let's get rid of those saplings on the ground. Okay, so this looks really nice here. Try and grow all the saplings if yeah, you can. Yeah, try that, but... Oh, that's a... That's a dense forest. Yeah, I'm trying to make this bit really dense, and then it'll thin out as it goes. I think we should have one of those in here, if this will... Yeah, it grows. Yeah, firstly, bone meal all those birches. Yeah, bone milling a piece of tall grass isn't gonna work really well. Yeah, and you do that one. Yeah, see, now you even have a nice foliage at the top with some multiple colors. And it starts decaying in some places, which makes it look more natural. Nice. I think it looks more natural. Yeah. But this is a really dark forest. <laughs> Over towards where I am, it's sort of thinning out. Yeah, well, maybe we should leave it open like this in this place, so it... That part is really dense, and this one is a bit more open. <laughs> Whoa! Wait, go right up as high as you can. Wait. Um, <laughs> just look at it. Oh, that's a nice forest. <laughs> I would keep it like that. Yeah, maybe just a few closer to the bridge, but yeah. Yeah, maybe some more in here. But that's... Normally it's really hard to get those big trees. Uh, well, let's see, we should get some leaves out and some glowstone. So we can make some lights in here. Yeah, put the lights actually in the yeah. leaves, do you think? So it's a glowing pathway. Or we could do torches along the look side. like that. Yeah, maybe I should put that one in a bit further. No, uh, don't do it like that. Do it, like, right inside. So you can't yeah, even no, see the... Yeah, no, that's not really um, gonna work everywhere, so... Well, maybe on the top you can do it here. Like that. Oh! I just got yeah. the tree in me. Yeah, that. And that's oh, nice. Right. Oh, look at um, that. Oh, this is dense. And we yeah. shouldn't do it everywhere. Just randomly like that oh that's yeah. a nice lighting yeah I think it works let's quite well. see where should we put one in here behind there yeah see some more maybe we shouldn't place it too close to each other as well yeah, keep them quite spaced out, so there's like those dark spots, but never dark enough yeah, for a mob to spawn. 
just like this one over here it's a bit darker but maybe mobs can spawn in here but oh well yeah I think I think they should be able to but not like right on the pathway I'm just hiding the glowstone randomly in the forest so you don't see it from above yeah but Oh, what was that? Oh, I was stuck. So you do like that. Oh, I need to get a lock. Where is the locks? Wait, why? Is yes. Took. <laughs> There's like loads of apples yeah, up at the top because here. of the decaying. Yeah. <laughs> She's like apple. Yeah, but see, that's nice. That really looks nice. And from the top you really can't see the better the Path, lights. Yeah. Oh, that's too much. See like this. So. Oh this is uh this is gonna be a difficult part to cross if you go and go through the whereabouts through the forest is that oh that looks nice here where yeah although um one more tree there what do you say? I don't think she's very hard at the moment, so... Maybe this corner should have some more light. Oh, this looks nice. <laughs> Just plant a forest, put some lights in it. Let's see, where should we do this one? Right there. Oh, this. What do you think of this light here? This here. Oh, it Which looks. One? If you stand here. Ah, uh, no. I'd say try and place it like two more blocks in or something. I wouldn't do that everywhere, just so. There's an opening in the forest Where here. Is it? Bad. <laughs> um, no, I wouldn't do it too now. much because this looks really natural from here. It's a bit thinner over here, but that's nice. Yeah, in theory, you need some trees a bit closer to the pot. Oh, we can. Also, just bone me all the ground a bit. Yeah, took. Uh, bone me all the ground, and then we'll get one sort of cold grass. Yeah, we should and get stuff. some more flowers in here, but. Yeah, um, one million the ground know, does that as well. So mostly good. you get tall grass. But still, yeah. Yeah, maybe we can just plant some flowers in it. I mean, I've got a lot of flowers from bone milling it. Every time you bone meal it, you get like one yellow, and every second time you get one yellow, one red. Um, oh, I'm lagging a bit, so I guess. Something's up here. Okay. Oh well, I guess we're already doing a pretty long recording. I don't know. How long is it like an hour? Check, so I'm gonna cut it here a bit. Forty minutes. <laughs> okay, guys. So uh, this this getting a bit long. Already over twenty-four minutes. So. 
that's gonna be it for this episode. We will work a bit on the forest off camera and we'll go on to episode 6 next. So till then, 